Breach Tutorials. Today we're going to try something a bit different. We've been teaching you how to use our Create Your Own Layout tool to make your own page rage layouts. But today we're going to go over what tools are available for you to make your own curtain designs and title bar designs. This is going to be a two-part lesson. So the first part we're going to tell you a little bit about Picasa and how to make your own custom curtain using Picasa. Picasa is a free photo web album service provided by Google. It's a convenient tool to make um, collages that are ideal for the curtain areas in your page range layouts. And so long as you have a Google account, you can use Picasa. So what you're going to do is download the Picasa tool to your computer. Um, you do have to download it in order to be able to use all of the features available to you. And once it is downloaded, you're going to want to set up your account so that you can use um, the, uh, the web albums as well. Once you have your account, the account set up and your software downloaded, you're going to go to Google Images and start searching for whatever photos you want to make your layout with. So we chose Megan Fox. News broke yesterday that she won't be returning to the Transformers sequel, so we made a little layout of Megan Fox for yesterday. You're going to save all the photos that you want to use to your desktop. And when you save photos, um, the nice thing about Picasa is that it will um, automatically find the photos once they've been saved. So we're just going to go over here. We have a folder and we're going to hit save. And you'll notice it's been added to our program Picasa. So first thing we're going to do is go in here and look for our album of Megan Fox. And here it is. And we're going to select the photos that we want to use. So first we're going to make a curtain using this image, this image, and this image. And then we're going to hit this little icon here that says Create Photo Collage. Now the nice thing about this feature is you can make your custom aspect ratios. So you'll see initially that this area is blank, but just go to Add Custom Aspect Ratio and you're going to input the values 1200 by 400. That is the ideal size for a left or right curtain. And once you've done that, all set. Now, right now, the setting that's being used is Picture Pile. You can have them styled as a mosaic, a frame, which doesn't really work because you were only using three photos, a grid, which will make them all even, um, a contact sheet or multiple exposure. So it just superimposes the pictures one on top of the other. We're going to go with the mosaic feature and then we want to put a little bit of spacing to kind of define the area a bit. So this grid spacing, it adds um, spacing between the photos and also around the entire image. You can change the color if you like but we're just going to stick with black. And then you would hit Create Collage, and it'll automatically create the collage for you. And as you can see, we have this one that we made yesterday. And then you would do the same thing for the other, your um, other curtain, if you want to do something similar. So we have this collage here, and this collage here that we made with Picasa. So that wraps it up for this lesson. Tune back in so we can show you how to make the title bar and go through how to upload all the images to your page page layout.